Yeah, I'm gonna go out on a limb before this one starts and just say, yeah, I, I know this match was absolute garbage. And I would use another word here, but I can't curse for the first 30 seconds. Uh, because YouTube. Uh, but the other one that I went and played was, again, Exodus Blue, which I don't hate, I, I don't like. I, I don't, I, I blanking hate that map. Uh, and on top of that, there was this beautiful player lagging, teleporting around the whole match. Uh, it was a mercy, and uh, there was a guy while hacking and aimbotting. So, that's cool. Um, I'll see you guys next week. Anyway, yo, I uh, hope you guys enjoy this one. Hello, everyone. We're back. So, I've got the high albedo here. Uh, cute little roll. You know me. You know how I like to do it. What does this give us? Oh, that's quite a few bullets. And we got an adhortative here. That's uh, one that you don't see very often. I have a cool little Take stupid shader on it. <laughs> we got Rusted Lands. And so, yeah, um, I just wanted to do a little cute commentary here and just kind of talk about 2020 and how. What the hell? That was the most limp nade throw. And how it's kind of all just coming to a close here. And how I think that. You know, 2021, new beginning, you know? Any help there? Any Anything? No? Okay. Anyway, so... 2020, coming to a uh, coming to a close here. It's been quite a year, my friends. We have, uh... All of us unanimously suffered gains, losses... Uh, and just... Just stuff in general, man. Hardships, good ships, up and down, circle square. Innovation in technology, uh, aggression in mental state, suppression, repression, depression, all of it. We've uh, we've gone through it as humanity, and what I have to say in regards to that is, this was a year that will go down in history. We we saw social reform. I got too bursted by a cold denial. We have a we we went through a lot. Sorry, I'm gonna continue there. Social reform with, uh, you know, human rights and social rights and, and uh, civil rights, especially, all being, you know, uh, just increased 20 fold all over the world. People are, you know, being treated and valued equally. Well, maybe not, like, immediately, but uh, recently in this year, and we've seen major strides here. We've seen the uh, insert thing, uh, 19, that I can't talk about because it'll get my video demonetized and this is a source of revenue for me although that's not necessarily why i do it anyway i digress so yeah and i just want to talk about it uh the last two days for me have been have been interesting <laughs> interesting indeed so uh yesterday i had a very close friend of mine we found out that they passed away they died that's it they died um and it's someone i talk to every day uh one of my runescape friends he's a a very cool guy, very close. Uh, he had maxed XP at 5.6 billion experience. He's a very skilled uh, PVMer, which is just kind of like PVE in that game, like where you fight bosses and stuff like that, and raids and stuff. Uh, a very cool guy, and uh, uh, he, he was a natural at many things he did. And he will be missed by his friends and family and the clan that we were in and all that stuff. And then to follow that up, I found out uh, just a few hours ago here, not even a few hours, isn't it? maybe like an hour, 20, 30 minutes, I don't know, that uh, a relative that I grew up around uh, passed away. And I'm not, I'm not here looking for sympathy or anything like that. I handle death way better than most people do, uh, and I'm, I'm blessed to have that gift, if that's what one would call it, a gift. Uh, perhaps it's because I've experienced too much of it. I'm stuck here right now. I'm stuck in the air. That was an unfortunate way to get stuck. I couldn't do anything there. Uh, perhaps it's because I've experienced too much of it, but I feel like, uh, I guess I just generate thoughts differently, you know? I just feel different. And while it's unfortunate I, uh, or not unfortunate, I always viewed it as just a factor of life, an unavoidable factor of life that nobody wants to go through and nobody wants to experience, but unfortunately it is what it is, and, you know, we don't always, we don't always get to win every battle. And so it's important to remember these kind of things uh, in these kind of times, especially these times with the thing 19 and... Oh man, I really got so super. Uh, and, you know, thing 19 and trying times, it's just... It, it, it's something that I, that I want to say is... And it's a mentality that I've always held, 
is it's important to remain your like maintain your composure and remain cool and composed during times like this because oftentimes you will be the only person who who is capable of that. Uh, and to to iterate on that again, just repeat it. It's it's very important for you to be the one who remains cool and composed because you may be the only one who does that. You may be the only one who does that. And that may be a very vague statement, but what I mean by that is, you know, the world could be falling apart as it is currently. Uh, with desperate efforts to put things back in place and this, that, and the other. But you just gotta understand that it is what it is. And... Wow, that was a lot of supers. They uh, really want to win. But if you, if you aren't the one composed, what if no one else is? You know, you have to have to keep your composure, even you know, no matter how unrealistic or how dire the situation may seem. And that's something that I've lived by, uh, because I, I've always been around very emotional people, which I feel like was a major driving force in me not being very emotional. And I think that, uh, again, I think I'm both blessed and cursed to have this. Uh, some people would kill to be like me. I don't think it's like a deficiency or anything like that. I don't think like I have like a social, uh, uh, social uh, I don't know, disorder or anything like that, but just how I am as a person. And uh, I like who I am, honestly. In any case, just keep that in mind, folks. It's important to be composed because if you're not composed, uh, no one else may be. I'm gonna helicopter this one. Tired of this guy, dude. Get out of here. A lot going down over here. All right, heavy ammo's coming up. But yeah, that that pretty much concludes the like the commentary I have to say. Man, everyone getting shots on me. I'm getting like no flinch factor or anything here. Oh yeah, just uh. I wanted to, you know, make a little commentary, if you guys are like, WHERE'S THE COMMENTARY SIDES? WE MISS COMMENTARY! And I'm like, yeah, 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 commentary's coming through. Dude, my whole team is getting ganked right here. It's like they just stopped playing or something. What happened? We had like a 1v5. Oh, he went for heavy, that's why. That makes sense. Alright, teammates cap and A. Sliding out here. This has been a pretty tough match for me, honestly. Uh, gotten some damage in, but not a ton, and just like, no, no kills really. I have a really low, like, fast kill potential here. I don't have anything with like a super crazy good kill ratio, or uh, like fast kill rate. Three minutes remaining. So it's uh, a little tough for me. I'm surprised I killed. In any case, coming up on our second Nova Bomb here. Naver Bomb. I'll set you Naver Bomb. Yeet! Out his ass. As a solo super AMA. I'm one of those Reddit kids now. Alright. Now you've evolved. I'm kinda hungry. I don't know if you can hear my stomach growling. I was gonna eat my food and then I decided I did wanted to um make a commentary and play the video game. Uh, which is actually what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna actually commentate now, sorry. In any case, hopefully, uh, you know, uh, looking forward to 2021 being a prosperous year and fun and cool and all that dank shit. Uh, it's been a tough one for sure. And I feel like that's putting it lightly. Unfortunate that I got flinched on that burst. That was, that was a crucial burst. And, uh, yeah. We get the, we get a good 2021. You know, keep grinding. Keep it together. Compose. Cool. Excited, dedicated, motivated, all that good stuff. Because, uh, you know, hey man, I'm glad we're in playing video games. If it's not, if you can't do it, you can't trust anyone else to do it sometimes. And that is how it is. Cruel, cold, facts of life. You smell me? Um, I'm done with this portion here. I'm gonna try to get the killy willy here. Cool. 37's in the burst. Alright, taking random damage from places I have no idea where from. Uh, all I saw was I got hit by a shuriken and all of my health was gone. As a shotgun, I'm not gonna get that kill. I like missed and couldn't get out of the door. And yeah, I couldn't get out of the door. I really should have whipped the sidearm out there. Uh, would have resulted in an extremely quick kill. 
Helicopter over. Melted. Looks like my teammates are, uh, again, continuously throwing over here over and over and over again, just kind of throwing their lives at this enemy team. Kobe! Alright, well, that was kind of weak. Um, yeah. Well, hey. So you can't win them all, right? You can't win them all. Unfortunate, but it is what it is. Uh, this is a very weak loadout. I'm kind of surprised at how, uh, like, how little I was actually getting kills. In any case, I wanted to do a little commentary, like I said. Um, we got about 30 out of that. Not too awful. Uh, everyone else is running some pretty geeky loadouts, so. Cool, cool. Later, dudes.